Hello everybody and welcome to Book Box Stories. My name is Emma and this is Buddy. Buddy is sitting on top of a very special box because inside this box are clues for today's story. Can you help me sing a song to open the box? Okay, I'll get my guitar. This song's called What's in the Box? What's in the box? Tell me your thoughts. What's in the box? Tell me your thoughts. Is it a clue? What's in the box? Tell me your thoughts. What's in the Maybe something from the sea that's washed up on the shore Let me see your thinking face And then we'll look and see What's inside the box today? Let's look inside the box. That was really great singing, everybody. But guess what? Yep, you're right. Buddy isn't here. He's disappeared again. Can you help me call his name? Okay, let's see if that works. After three. One. Two, three, buddy. Can you see him? I don't think it worked. Shall we call his name even louder? Yeah. Okay, let's go. One, two, three, buddy. buddy. Buddy, say hello to everybody. Were you hiding from us again? But your hiding place this week was inside the box, which means it's already open. So we don't need to open it up again. So you come and sit on my knee. There we go. And we'll look inside the box. This is interesting. It's a leaf. Inside their box was a leaf. And it's got some little holes in it, as if something's been chewing through it. So our first clue is a leaf. Let's look inside for more clues. Are you ready for this one? What's that? So let's think. Clue number one was a leaf. Clue number two was a bowl of fruit. 
I'm going to need some more clues. Shall we look inside again? This one looks tasty. It's a plate full of sweet things. Got an ice cream, lollipops, mm. so clue number one was a leaf, clue number two was a bowl of fruit and clue number three was a plate of some sweet things. I think you might guess our story after this next clue. Look! It's a caterpillar. Clue number four is a caterpillar. I think I know what today's story is. But there's one more clue inside our box. Let's have a look and see if we're right. right. Today's story is called The Very Hungry Caterpillar and it's written and illustrated by Eric Carle. In the light of the moon, a little egg lay on a leaf. One Sunday morning, the warm sun came up and pop, pop out of the egg came a very tiny and very hungry caterpillar. He started to look for some food. On Monday, he ate through one apple, but he was still hungry. On Tuesday, he ate through two pears, but he was still hungry. On Wednesday, he ate through three plums, but he was still still hungry. On Thursday, he ate through four strawberries, but he was still hungry. On Friday, he ate through five oranges, but he was still hungry. On Saturday, he ate through one piece of chocolate cake and one ice cream cone, one pickle, one slice of Swiss cheese, one slice of salami and one lollipop, one piece of cherry pie and one sausage, one cupcake and one slice of watermelon. That night he had a stomachache. The next day was Sunday again. The caterpillar ate through 
one green leaf. And after that, he felt much better. Now, he wasn't hungry anymore. And he wasn't a little caterpillar anymore. He was a big, fat caterpillar. He built a house around himself called a cocoon. And he stayed inside for more than two weeks. Then he nibbled a hole in the cocoon and he pushed his way out. And he had become a beautiful butterfly. Thank you for joining us again for another story session. I hope you enjoyed that one. My favourite part was when the caterpillar turned in to the beautiful butterfly. Now just like every story we do, I have wrote a song and this one is all about food. Would you like to hear it? All right, let's go sing.
like it raw, like it cooked For my snack, for my tea Healthy eating's what I need I like cake, I like sweets But those things are special treats Listen to what I say Remember each your father day Thank you for joining our story session today. Remember, if you liked it, you can like, share and subscribe and maybe I'll see you again next time. Bye! <laughs>